create sheet for roof. For that, go to steel, select here beam, then go to here profile, make it. If you go down, you can see here sheet. Click here, select this one. Then if you go down, I select this one. 1058, it is our effective width of this sheet. Select this one. If you want, you can select any sheet. But I select here this one. You can select any sheets and you can use it. Select this one, apply and click OK. Now, I just click here above the purlin. Then I just click here. It is placed. Now, if you go to the 3D, press Ctrl Tab. It is created this side. You can see here it is created this side. Now this one is created like this. Select this one. Then go to here. Make it 180 degree. Then enter. It will change like this. Press Ctrl or you can see this one very clearly. Here it is created in middle, but I just change here to right. It is changed like this. Now go to view, select here view list. I select this level, double click this one, it will open. Then you can select this sheet, right click, move. Click any location, then make it perpendicular, shift right click, go to perpendicular and you can place it. Now if you go to 3D view, press control tab, here it is placed our sheet. But we need it this side and this side also we need it some extension. For that go to here. I select this one, I change this color also, if you want you can change any color, I change this color, then I simply enter, here it is place, then make it here, this is a starting location, minus 750, then I just make it here, it is 250, after this parlay, it is 500 is safe, but 750 is okay, 500 or below 500 is it is good but 750 also okay but don't exceed more this hanging location at least if you keep 500 that is very good but it is 750 okay if it is going more than 1 meter it will trouble now this one is 250 now I just go to the 3D view, you can see what we created. We created up to this pearl. Now I just go here, select this one, then go to view, select here work plane, parallel to view plane. Now I just click outside, you will get it here like this. Then select this one, right click, copy special, mirror, click this middle then I click here then copy so now you can see here this sheet copied this side also now press escape key press control and you have to select like this then right click copy special mirror again click this point click this point then copy so now this side also copied. Then go to this sheet, then go to the properties. We have to change few more things also. 
this side make it 500 then enter similar way select this one make it this one minus 500 then enter just keep as it is if you want you can make a little bit also more just make it here minus 450 then select this one also I just make it here 450 so you will get a little more gap now select press control and we need to select all the sheet then we need to change the name it is roofing sheet roofing sheet then make it here part number it is sheet so I just make it here SH assembly mark just make it some difference SHT other all the things keep as it is then modify we need to change the material also for that go to here select the catalog then go to material catalog you can select any steel material you can select then select this one right click copy the grade and make it this one name GI roofing sheet roofing sheet other all the thing keep as it is if you want you can change the density and all but it is okay just keep as it is then click ok now here it is added click ok ok then go to here type GI you will get it here GI roofing sheet then click ok so now this one is okay. select this one modify here it is now if you go to the 3d all the sheets are perfectly placed we need to arrange this sheet all the area so select all the sheets again now go to the view select here work plane select this work plane tool just place it like this so our x direction you will get it here like this now right click cancel press escape key just right click then go to copy special linear make it you can see this is the effective width so i just make it here 1058 then number of quantity now i just make it here quantity i just make it approximately 50 quantity or you can calculate the quantity also here you will get it in between distance and total distance you can calculate and divide the total distance total distance divide by 1058 how many quantity you will get it and I just make it here 50 quantity then if you copy you can see the sheets are copied like this now press escape key click outside you can select the few more sheets also now I just make little more 6 sheet copy we need it one more sheet also one more sheet and here it is so now you can see here these sheets are placed perfectly you can see this sheet little bit extend that one we can cut and remove or we have another one more option you can select the sheet then if you go to here profile the same sheet you will get it here with 840 effective width so the same sheet only the changes you will get it the width only i just select this one then apply and click ok then modify you can see the changes then also we need to remove some portion just keep as it is if it is required we will remove that one finally i select this profile copy this profile select this one select this one select this one then i just go here control v then modify here it is changed so now all the roofing sheets we placed if you need to change any color or if you need to change material 
or glass material any trans solution sheet if you need to add that also you can add it here 